Good day everyone, this is Elvin Peria of www.elvinperia.com And today, I'll be discussing or I'll be demonstrating to you how to set up your Microsoft Office tools for an email blast. To give you an overview, here's what's gonna happen. Microsoft Word will transfer the information, the message body as well as the, the unique information coming from Microsoft Excel and then merge it and send it to Microsoft Outlook and then Microsoft Outlook will send it using our Gmail account okay so I'll, I'll just demonstrate this one with an example I have here the Excel file which contains name nickname and email address and then also I have here a Word document which contain the message okay and also, I have here the Microsoft Outlook, which is linked to my Gmail account, which is efrenelvin at gmail.com. So let's start. So I'll start with the Microsoft Word document. I'll just click on mailings. So this is the message body, and I'll include the nickname. I'll, I'll have the message, hi, Elvin, or hi, nickname. And then I'll send it to this email address. Okay. So in Microsoft Word, click on mailings. And then select recipients. And use existing list. So the assumption here, you have an existing list, which, which is the Microsoft Excel file. So I'll just look at that one. This one, sample DB1. Okay, and then I'll be using sheet 1. And then I'll type in hi. And then I'll insert merge field. So you can see if it's connected, if the Excel file is connected to your Word document, you can see here the column name, which is which can be found in this one. Okay. So I'll insert a merge field nickname, comma. Let's include good day. Okay. So you can preview the results by clicking preview results. And you'll see that the greeting line is now changed. Or the merge field is now changed. If, if you want to check out the other entries, you can click on this one, next record. And you'll see that um, the nickname changed. Okay. And once you're done, you, can, you click on finish and merge. And then send email messages. By clicking send email me messages, a pop-up window will appear. And just click on message option. So two would be will be using the email address. Subject line, just enter the subject. Let's say um, email blast setup. And then mail format, you can use attachment, plain text, or HTML if you have pictures or something like that. Usually I'm using HTML. And then you can select if it's uh, the current record only or selected records only. But in our case, I'll use all. Okay, so right after this one, click on OK. Then we'll check on Microsoft Outlook to see if our message it's there can you see here that I have three messages going to different email address there the outbox is now um, back to zero it has no it's now empty so we can check our email address if we got the message okay so I'll be going to uh, mail.yahoo.com to see if this one if I got the email Imperia. also I'll go to the also I'll go to dot com. so this is the three email address I tried
Okay. So first, on elvinperio.yahoo.com, you can see here that I have, no, not this one. I, I got the message. It has the email blast set up. And this is the sample message. You can see here that the nickname I've used in the Excel file, this one, Elvin, is the, uh, what do you call this? The name captured. And also, you can notice that other email address does not exist in this one. Just the elvinperiatyahoo.com email uh, address. Okay. In Pinoy Excel guru.com here's the same message and in gmail okay you can see that i have sent same message but with a different nickname okay so hope you learned from this um, setup and happy email blasting. See you in the next video. Bye.